You're not dreaming, it's the moon dreamers Dreaming up dreams for me and you You're not dreaming, it's the moon dreamers Making your sweetest dreams come true They work at night when the lights are low They give off such a beautiful glow They feed sweet dreams both near and far From a beautiful magical star You're not dreaming, it's the moon dreamers Helping to make things turn out right you're not dreaming, it's the moon dreamers, moon dreamers, make your dreams take flight. eat mostly anything. Very funny. Who are you? My name is Ursa Major. I'm a solar bear. That loud mouth is named Rory, the flying lion. At your service. Who are you? My name's Blinky, and she's Bitsy. She's real shy. Why in Saturn's name were you in the ocean of unconsciousness? We fell in by accident. We were on our way to Staria. Staria? Is that a city? Yes, it's where the moon dreamers live. We want to be moon dreamers. What's a moon dreamer? They make dreams for children on Earth. Want to come with us? Maybe you can be moon dreamers too. Sounds like fun. Yeah, hop on. Gee, thanks. Ooh. Off we go. Ursa, where are you and Rory from? We were in a star circus until one day we were kidnapped. Kidnapped? Yes, by the evil Queen Scowleen, ruler of Monstrous Middle. Where's Monstrous Middle? It's down below us, somewhere. Under Earth? No, above Earth, but below us. It's in the middle. Who's Scowleen? Well, let me tell you about Scowleen. She's a mean, crabby queen who can't sleep. She made us jump all night long so she could count us like sheep. Did that make her sleep? Just the opposite. <gasps> My fur made her sneeze. <laughs> While she was sneezing, we escaped. And one way or the other, we made our way here. It's the home of the Moon Dreamers! What do you want? Oh, hello. We want to become Moon Dreamers. My name is Blinky. This is Bitsy. I'm Sparky. But we don't need help, so go home. Oh, dear. Can we at least come in? Nope. Only authorized personnel allowed. Sorry. But, but we came so far. I 
don't think those moon dreamers do anything anyway. Earth kids just dream, and those moon dreamers take all the credit. What? We do our own dream work here. Prove it. Why, I... <laughs> Step right this way. When the kids of Earth think good thoughts, that creates positron energy. That's what we use for power in Starry Up. Well, little friends, do you like how we make dreams? Oh, yes, Crystal. Can we be moon dreamers, too? I'm afraid not, Blinky. You see, we don't need any more moon dreamers. Ah, fiddle stars. Cheer up, partners. How'd you like to make a star delivery with old Bucky Buckaroo? Oh, yes, Bucky. Please. We'll ride like the wind on my favorite comet, Halley. Here's the dream, Crystal Bucky. Ride carefully. Thanks, Whimsy. Giddy up, Halley, old gal. Away! Yippee! It's a black hole cover. It covers dangerous black holes. They're doorways between Starry Up and Monstrous Middle. That's where Scalene lives. Yes. Don't touch. They're doorways between Scalene's and our world. So whatever you do, never open one up. Never. Come on. Our job's done here, little star folks. Time for us to get back. Time for dreams to begin. <laughs> At last. I've been waiting so long to get up here and turn a good dream into a bad, scowly dream. <laughs> Isn't my scowly dream crystal beautiful? <laughs> Me and Galaxia towed the moon into place. Good, Celeste. Now let's dreamcast our first dream tonight. <laughs> Stuck in that scowly dream forever! I've done it! I've done it! 
coming from the star that's beaming Tommy's dream. Sounds like Scowleen's work. Scowleen? Here? But how? I've checked all the black hole covers near that star. Uh-oh. What's wrong, Blinky? I did a bad thing. I kicked a black hole cover. And maybe loosened it up. I'm sorry. Don't worry. It was an accident. I'll signal the snoozers to meet us at that star in case there's trouble. It's tacky, but effective. Right, a 
Professor, do your stuff. This ought to shake things up. Yowler, you idiot! I'm allergic to that mess, but for her! Uh, achoo! Achoo! from that scowly dream is wrecking the North Star, and the front door is blocked. The only way in is the ventilator shaft, but I'm too big to fit. Oh no, if we don't get in, the North Star might blow up, and Starry Up will be destroyed. This is all my fault. Dreams will be great. 